Hey guys! Uh, today I'm doing the look in which you saw the pictures uh, before of the Reflex Transparent Teal is the color. Um, it's a glitter that came in this size, a very petite size, but it's in the uh, holiday kit that has the number 7 lashes, the zoom lash, and the felt tip liner. And that kit is exclusive to Nordstrom, so um, I believe you can check it out on Nordstrom.com or go to a Nordstrom in your area um, while supplies last. And I've also used the Nude Rose uh, Lipstick. It's a luster and piff lip gloss, which were requested um, on my opinion about that, which I think are gorgeous, and you'll see me use it if you stay tuned for the video. Also wanted to show you guys something that I found at Target. It is the coolest thing ever. And it is like this little um, bucket. And it's got dividers in it, and it was just like, in the Halloween section, perfect for my makeup brushes. It's got a cute little skull and crossbone on it. Anyway, actually, uh, my husband found it. I was there shopping with him, and he's like, honey, look what I found for your makeup brushes, which was like, oh, so romantic. It totally warmed my heart. I couldn't believe it. <laughs> it was very sweet and uh, so I absolutely love it. So check out Target in the Halloween section if you like something like this for your brushes because it fits under the bathroom counter awesome or it just looks cute sitting out if you want to have it sitting out. So stay tuned um, for the video. It's going to start right now. Okay, so here is the Reflex Transparent Teal up close, and it's actually really simple. So you're just going to start out with a primer, which I've used the Urban Decay Primer Potion. Then I am going to take the Grease Paint Pencil from the Style Black in the black color. It's got a little purple iridescence to it, and I'm going to put that all over the lid not all the way in and you want to make sure that's nice and opaque on there covering the lid and you're just going to take a this is a, a what? you're just going to take a 236 brush and blend out that top area any of the edges and you want to do this really quickly after putting it on because this stuff dries really quick Okay, now that you have that blended out, I'm going to take this mixing medium and it's just glycerin mixed with water. And I'm going to spray it directly on my face, um, kind of aiming at my eye. <laughs> and it kind of makes you jump back a little bit. <laughs> then I'm going to take a different 239 brush and I'm going to go into the glitter which I've put on this piece of paper and tap that onto the lid. going all the way into the corner with it, putting it under on the lash line right here in the tear duct area. Then I am going to take the grease paint pencil again and put it right in the lash line, right just to meet where you have the glitter there, taking a small angled brush and blending that out and up. You want to just come out to the side with this, just creating like a line right from the bottom lash line just straight out. Then I'm going to take a 217 brush and just a coal black matte color. This is Bobbi Brown. You can use Carbon by MAC if you have that. I'm going to start here on the bottom and just make circular motions. Actually, what I should have done before I added the black was come with the highlight color, Mylar. It's a matte color. And just put that on the brow bone. Okay, so just blend that black. And I'm going to take a black coal liner. This is the Makeup Forever in black and line the waterline and tight line and then come into the lash line with it all the way across 
pulling it up, winging it out here on the end. Going back with the angled brush into the black. I'm setting that line on the bottom. Even though it's like waterproof, you really don't have to set it. And then I'm going to pull that black down into the lash line so you don't have any skin showing at the lash line. So it's all black. Do the same thing on the top. Okay, so now I'm going to show you a little trick. I'm going to take this foundation brush, or I actually use it for concealer, and just pull this up. Make a nice crisp line there at the bottom. And you can create any shape you want using this. If you want to pull it out, if you wanted to make it more rounded, you could come this way with it. So this way you don't have to worry about getting your shadow perfect out here because you can always go back and like clean that up later afterwards. So now I'm going to curl my eyelash and I'm going to use the Zoom Lash, which I love. And then I'm going to use this number seven eyelash. All this came in the holiday kit that I bought. Okay, so there you have it. The Reflex uh, Glitter a kit that comes in the new holiday collection. Um, Reflex Transparent Teal is what it's called and it's exclusive to Nordstrom. comes with the glitter, the eyelashes, and the zoom lash, and a liner. Uh, which I didn't use the liner for this video, but it's worth it just for this glitter because it's gorgeous. And as you can see, it kind of turns a little bit purple. It's got like a purple undertone because of that grease paint pencil that I used with it. So stay tuned and I'll show you what I used on the rest of my face. Okay, so I really haven't used um, this a bronzer very much lately, but I really want to for some reason. I know like summer's over in most cities. Um, but I just, I don't know, a lot of the colors in the collection had a lot of bronzy undertones to them, so why not? Uh, this is the Lorac Bronze, and it's a, got some shimmer in it. It's called Tantalizer, and it's, I don't know, there's not a color on it. It just says Tantalizer Baked Matte Satin Bronzer SPF 15, and I'm going to use a big fluffy Sigma brush. And I'm going to do that all over my cheek, coming from the apple back up. Then I'm going to use the um, Nude Rose. I had a request from one of my subscribers to swatch the Nude Rose, use the Nude Rose, uh, nude rose and um, I have it here, so I will swatch it on my lips for you. This is what the color looks like nude rose. Now in my opinion this is really a beautiful color although it is very nude and I think it just kind of I think a little bit of your skin tone on your lip kind of peeks through. I'll zoom in so you can see it. Okay so there you have the nude rose and I'm going to use the PIF color which is a dazzle glass it's kind of a blush, kind of peachy blush color on top of it, which is really beautiful together. So there you have the look. Thank you all so much for watching. Um, don't forget to rate, comment, and subscribe. And um, I'll be doing some more looks from this collection and probably playing with this glitter a bit more. I also have... Um, a couple of other new things that I got that I can share with you all and I'll do a little mini haul from the beauty store and I have tons of requests from you guys that I have a list started and I am going down that list um, in the order that I receive the request so um, stay tuned for your request and I will reference uh, the person who requested it so you know uh, that it is your video that um, I'm doing. So um, don't forget to rate, subscribe, and comment, and I'll see you all very soon. Thank you for watching. Bye.